much for tuning in today. Today I figured I would do a full face using all Fenty products. I know it's been a minute since I done that because my last video that was just strictly all Fenty was my initial first impression when the brand first launched. And a lot of you guys really enjoyed that video. Thank you so much for the feedback on that video. Like that's one of my favorite videos that I've ever done because I was genuinely surprised and excited to try out the products. So a lot of this stuff has become a fave. It has become a staple in my makeup routine. So I wanted to come back on camera and do a full face using some products and some new stuff because we got some new friends y'all that I'm trying to introduce y'all to today. So these are the two new friends. Say hello to Who Needs Clothes and Brown Sugar. These are the Fenty Body Lavas. When she launched this y'all, I, I got, I almost lost lost my mind I really did <laughs> now you guys know your girl likes to glow right but this is like glow on a hundred can you see what we're doing today can you see the level of glow we achieved today this had me just like at a loss for words you know what I mean like you know your girl likes to glow so I had to cop these I had to and I know I'm late to the party I'm, I'm always late okay I'm always fashionably late there's a difference even when I'm late I still be coming through so I've been using this so I'm not I'm not new to this I got it as soon as it launched and I've been playing around with it but I've never showed you guys on camera and I feel like this look is just so just gorgeous I'm here for this makeup look so I just want to share this with you guys how I achieved this look we're gonna do a full face using Fenty there's some new products Products coming out that I'm excited to try so I'll probably do a summer Fenty look this is my spring Fenty look but yeah y'all so without rambling if you want to see how I achieve this bomb glow on a hundred look let's go ahead and dive right into the video we're gonna start off by priming our skin I'm gonna use the soft matte pro filter primer I'm almost out of this stuff like I'm so sad about it because I really like this this has been the only primer that I've been using since I did that initial um, first impression video so that says a lot I really like this primer even when I use it with other products I feel like it just makes my makeup last um, it's moisturizing what the heck is that it's moisturizing it lasts long and it just sets my makeup in really well I'm gonna apply my foundation the shade that I have and been using is 410 I know you guys some of you guys said to try out um, 400 I'm gonna try out 400 I want to see what that shade does for me but so far this one's cool my skin is looking extra glowy y'all <laughs> I have a skincare video coming up really really soon but I'm kind of happy with my skin she's been treating me pretty well what I love about this foundation you really don't need a lot of this to get a very nice natural look it just makes your skin look really really good I'm almost out of my foundation too, so I'm gonna have to re-up on my foundation, on my primer. But what I'm happy about, like when did I when did this launch? I think it launched last September. So I've been using it ever since. And I feel like that's a pretty good like amount of time. So you definitely get a lot. I mean, it's not the cheapest foundation or the cheapest products because they are sold at Sephora. But still, I mean it lasts you a good amount of time. And overall, I mean, the most important part is that it works really well. Okay, so that is the complexion. Doesn't it look amazing? Like, doesn't it look amazing? Without me gassing myself up, am I the only one that feels that way? Like, I feel like it looks really, really good right now. Really good. Like, Fenty does this to me all the time, you guys. It's just a bomb foundation. Okay, so let's get on to the highlights and contour. Okay, so I'm gonna take my matchstick in Espresso. Now I'm just going to blend that in. I like to tap first before I buff it. I love how this looks on my complexion. Like I feel like it's the perfect, adds the perfect warmth to my skin. It doesn't make me look overly red. Okay, so next I'm going to apply my matchstick in caramel. And I'm gonna highlight with this one. I'm gonna be completely honest. I don't reach for this one as often as I do like my other brand concealers. I just feel like it's okay but it's not like it's not my favorite concealer for highlighting it's not bad at all it's just not my favorite so warm it up on my skin and then apply it I do want them to come out with something a little bit more golden yellowish 
I really want them to come out with something a little bit more yellow. And then I'm just going to buff my concealer in with my contour. It definitely brightens under your eyes. So if you have dark circles or you didn't get enough sleep the night before, this will definitely just brighten you up a bit, make you look more awake, more, you know, alert. So far my skin is looking pretty good. What do you guys think? I feel like it's blending in with my complexion. <laughs> now Fenty does not have any baking products, unfortunately. Riri, can you come out with some baking products? I know if you come out with baking products, I already know I'm gonna be baked to death. Okay, so please, just hear my prayers. I'm just gonna go ahead with my Sasha Buttercup um, because this is my old faithful. And I'm just going to bake the highlighted areas but yeah I really want Fenty to come out with a baking product okay so I went ahead and did the rest of my complexion because the products that I use aren't available at Fenty Beauty um, because they haven't launched these products like face powders um, contour powder all that stuff so I had to use other brands so I figured why show you that this is supposed to be like a Fenty video so now we're gonna move on to blush I'm gonna use this one by Fenty this is their kilowatt blush in ginger binge in Moscow mule honestly I haven't really played in this um, yeah in general I haven't really played in it so I'm um, today is gonna be like my first time really wearing it I'm gonna use this Fenty brush to apply it I'm also gonna use this brush I was about to say blush this brush by Fenty which I rarely use I believe it's their highlighter brush never really use it both of these are pretty new to me because I've never really you know used them so let's start with what is this ginger binge it's a gorgeous pink shade because I'm feeling kind of pinky today so let's just apply that it's pretty it has a sheen to it so it's kind of highlighting my cheek area which I don't know how I necessarily feel about that because it just looks like a big highlighted spot on my face like I'm, I'm getting more sheen than color payoff okay so scratch that I'm gonna have to use a different blush because that one's just not it's not gonna cut it for my complexion it just looks pretty it's a pretty like if I were to highlight with it but as a blush that's that's not cute I'm just gonna go in with Milani Coral Cove see what that does okay so I'm not too mad now um, ginger binge on a lighter complexion as a blush would be perfect so if you have lighter skin then ginger binge would look totally cool on you but for my complexion it would only work as a highlighter it really it really wouldn't look right as you guys saw as a blush it, it just highlights that area Next, I'm gonna go into Moscow Mule and I'm gonna use that as a highlighter. Let's hope for the best for this one. It is pretty, I will give it that. It is definitely, actually, depending on the look you do, it's not bad. Like, I wanna love it, but I don't know. It, it is pretty, I'm not gonna lie. It is a pretty highlighter. I just don't know if I'm here for it all the way. You know what, I'm gonna go in with rum. Let me just, first apply it to okay so rum is pretty maybe we should do rum I prefer to apply it on my finger and dab it in let's just see what rum is gonna do for us whoa okay that's that's pretty bright <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to do all of that <laughs> so far I think it's pretty after working with it more um, and playing with the rum matchstick, I kind of like this. All right, so I'm moving on to eyes. And the first product I'm gonna start off with, I'm just gonna bronze my eyes. This product is not by Fenty, but since they don't have um, an eyeshadow color in the particular shade that I want, I'm just gonna go ahead and use just my bronzing powder or contour powder by, uh, who is this? Black Radiance. So I'm gonna use that in the crease of my eye. Next, I'm gonna go into my Fenty Galaxy palette. And I haven't used this palette in so long. You, <gasps> What happened? I'm so sad, y'all, look at that. I don't know what happened. I haven't used it <laughs> since the video I did. So I'm trying to figure out what eyeshadow I want to use for this particular look. Okay, so this one's kind of cute. The, the one that I'm so sad that broke. This one is Sunburst. I'm gonna try Sunburst. I'm using a brush, but I think I might go in with my finger 
and just yeah that's really pretty I love the reflexes in this there's orange there's pink I forgot how bomb this palette was I don't really reach for it but for those everyday like shimmer looks this would be really cute and just blend that out Am I serving spring yet? I think I'm serving spring. I really like that color. That's so cute. Yeah, that's a bomb color. Let's do some inner corner highlighting. Let's try this one right here. You guys know how I, I love inner corner highlight. Add some bronzer to my bottom lash line. Okay, so we're gonna move on to lips and I'm trying to figure out what I wanna do for my lips. I wanna keep it very like pretty, glossy, nothing too crazy. So I'm going to apply rum on my lips. Let's just see how this is going to look. Ooh, that's kinda cute, y'all. Isn't this a cute color? Those matchsticks be coming through for real. I'm gonna go ahead and apply my Fenty Gloss because I feel like it's gonna make this really pop. I think that's so pretty. So I'm definitely here for all of this. The face look is popping, okay? All right, so now we're gonna move on to the body, all right? We gotta get this body glowing. It needs to coordinate with the face because the face is beat. Now we just need to beat this body. So Fenty recently came out with their body lavas and whew, I'm telling y'all, when I seen that they were gonna launch this, I, 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 knew, I knew I had to have it. Literally, I've been looking for a body highlighter that wasn't too like sheer because a lot of times the oils are sheer it's more shiny than glittery and i love to sparkle i really do so these i just felt like this was like the perfect product i've been using them i actually like used this for my sister's wedding i think all the bridesmaids used mine <laughs> for the wedding so it's kind of on the low low so this one is who needs clothes i think that's the name of it and it's a more champagne-y one and this one is in this one is in brown sugar and this one gives you the most beautiful golden glow like bronze to the max okay i'll probably swatch both for you guys so you can see how it looks on my complexion but i'm definitely here for this one because i feel like it's going to coordinate with this look really well i also bought the pom-pom too and the packaging again the packaging is cute like i just put this in my in my background and it, it's just something that looks really really cute so i'm going to try them all today for you guys now i didn't get the kabuki brush because they were sold out on sephora and they didn't have any more in my sephora so that was a bummer okay so i'm gonna go ahead and apply who needs clothes onto my skin i am obsessed with this product let me know if you guys have tried this but i cannot put it down like at all i'm gonna take the stippling brush and this is the brush that i've been using do you see that? Oh, like, I can't. Instantly popping, glowing skin. Like, that is beyond gorgeous. It gives you sun-kissed skin right away. Like, you just look like you belong at the beach. Okay, so this is Who Needs Clothes. Very pretty. See how it just picks up that light? literally transforms your skin. So see this side, natural glow, Fenty glow. Okay, so on this side, I'm going to apply brown sugar just so you guys can see how it looks. Ooh, that color. So this one's definitely more golden. We're just going to blend that in. Ooh, that's so pretty. Okay, so off back, I noticed the difference between these two. Brown sugar is more of a golden sheen. It looks more like a really bomb, moisturized oil on your skin versus Who Needs Clothes looks, it has a little bit more glitter in it. If you have not tried this, I highly suggest you get this for summer. Like, why not? Why not add more, huh? You know what, just for the heck of it, I'm going to try Who Needs Clothes on my lips. I just wanna see what it does. Like, I can't. That is so pretty. All right, you guys, I'm glowing, okay? Okay, so the glow is on 10. It's definitely a hot 10, maybe 100. I'm gonna go ahead and try the puff. Now, supposedly, when you use this, 
it's supposed to add like rose glow rose glow rose gold <laughs> glitter to your like glow to your skin so I'm gonna go ahead and do it it's very it's a really cute puff let me see if anything comes out of this like you literally have to beat it into submission so I do see a little bit of sheen there's a little bit of sheen there um Oh, that is, I mean, I do see something coming out of it. But for the price, like how much glitter is actually in this? That is pretty, I'm not gonna lie. That actually is, oh my God. Okay, that actually, how many times am I gonna say actually? Let's just beat ourselves into the glow. So I definitely can see a difference between this shoulder and this shoulder. Let's add it. So this actually does work. I just wanted it just to test it, just to test it out and because I thought it was pretty. <laughs> I really thought the packaging was super pretty. Sometimes the packaging can get you, but glitter does, like it's not glitter, it's more of a, a, a sheen, very small sheen of glitter. That's really pretty, y'all. The puff is definitely not a necessity, but it does add that subtle sheen to it. And if you're not a fan of like, oils like glittery oils and stuff then you might want to try the puff it does do something so it's not just a gimmick it does add a nice little glow and sheen y'all i cannot get over this glow i really cannot i'm ready for some sun i'm ready for a vacation i could really use a beach right now i really could all right you guys so that is the makeup look i really do enjoy this face i really do enjoy this look fenty does it again never lets me down i'm excited for the new products i did see a little sneak peek of some of the items that they're coming out with on their instagram page um so i'm here for it i'm here for the summer because i feel like they're gonna bring something leave it to rihanna to bring something super hot dope for the spring and summer like i'm here for it sis so like you know come through let me know what you guys think about this makeup look i absolutely love this look very simple very spring appropriate all about the skin this look is definitely about the skin i absolutely love these products so much i feel like they just make your skin just look glorious and just like your credit score is amazing and you know your bank account is filled there's no drama in your life you're drinking your water you're minding your business and you're blessed that's what this glow says right here if you enjoyed this full face using fenty then you know what let me know down below let me know in the comment section what products you have tried by fenty what products you love by fenty or what products you are wanting to try and please do not click out of this video without subscribing if you aren't subscribed and give this video a thumbs up it really helps the channel out it lets me know what type of videos you guys like and um yeah y'all i can't like i just keep looking at this shoulder come through shoulder blade like let's it's cutting y'all it's cutting also know what other brands you would like me to do a full face you know makeup tutorial on i think i want to do maybe cover girl next i'm not sure but whatever brand you would like for me to just do a full face on drugstore high end whatever let me know in the comment section down below i love this look so i'm gonna go i'll see you guys in my next video Bye.